welcome to Catharsis, where we work you up about everything amorism. I'm Step, he, she, they, let's go! What are we talking about today? We're gonna talk about slut shaming. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> don't call me a slut. Yeah, I think slut shaming is a huge problem and I don't think it goes both ways for girls and guys and that's just something I've always been confronted by and had an issue with. Tell me more. So for example, in high school, like I like to make out with people. It's fun. It's you so know? much fun. It's so much fun. It's great, right? And like it was always in, like, in an empowered way. Like constantly it was just like, oh, well, you're a slut. But what about him <laughs> and him? No, 100%, like you don't get to call me that. It's me doing what I want with me and getting what I want out of the world. And like, that's it. Absolutely, yeah. absolutely. Um, and, how, and how has that changed to you? Just be like, if you're gonna call me that, you're just not gonna be part of the conversation. It's great. <laughs> now as a person, I don't put myself around people that I feel like I have to say sorry for what I'm doing. And that's like, that's a lot of feeling that I think of many girls go through. There's that pressure to say yes. And if you say no, it's either like, I'm offending you. And then you call me like a bitch or whatever. Cause you're all like, you know, hurt. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If you don't want to make out, there's something wrong with you. It's not me, it's you. And then if you say yes, you're a slut. That sucks. Like, those are my options. That doesn't put much fun into, like, being with someone in a physical sense. Especially if you give that yes, which isn't an authentic yes. It's like you were just pressured and you were kind of like, no, no. And he was like, but come on, you know, and like, what or she, whatever. I didn't even want to do this. And now I'm getting shit on for it. Can I say that on camera? Yeah. Shit. Sorry. <laughs> and then it goes even to, like, the way people dress. I mean, I can be fully upfront and guilty about this too. Like, I think it comes from a place of insecurity, but if I see a woman dress provocatively, I'm like, ho, oh, you know? And like, then I dress provocatively and I'm pissed when people are like, ho. Oh. <laughs> so yeah. Well, so, why do you do that? Well, part of it, I think sexuality is empowering, but then the other part of it, of course, is that's what society expects from me as a young woman. Mm -hmm. You know, they want to see that. There's definitely been the experience of like, that gets me more of what I want. We are in a patriarchal society. As much as we don't want to be, we are. That definitely helps you move ahead in the world, in the patriarchy. And it sucks. I got into this concert for free or whatever. So you're at the concert and you're like enjoying the concert, but like you're also ridden with feeling like shit about yourself and feeling super objectified. What would be ideal would be like education. I think as girls, like you're taught so much from a young age to like be the leader and like this is how you deal with it and like here's how you keep yourself safe, right? And like that education for guys just isn't present. How can we actually empower men? Like when they hear a no, they don't internalize it. Just deal with it in a more mature fashion. There it is, women's empowerment. <laughs> It's time to smash the patriarchy. <laughs> what we have here is a real live representation of the patriarchy. <laughs> the patriarchy. And we are going to crush it. This is <laughs> girls that are horny too and get called sluts because of it. Smash it up! <laughs> what happens when the patriarchy gets all over you? <laughs> Isn't it all I'm covered in the <laughs> patriarchy! Get it off, girl! Get it off, girl! Get it off! Thank you so much for watching. Wasn't that awesome? If you like that video, click through to our channel, Slayful. We are number one in everything amorism. Every single like, comment, share, everything makes the world a more sex positive place. You are making the movement, everything you do. Thank you so much for making it happen. And I'll catch you next time.